And welcome back to Target Field as Whit Merrifield has been in the big leagues just a little less than a week. We have seen him in left field. We have seen him at third base. We have seen him at second. He's got his first hit. He's got his first multi-hit game, his first double, and staying productive here in the big leagues. And it is a thrill right now to be joined by his grandfather. We keep showing Bill Merrifield Sr. over and over again to the point where he's he's getting messages now from, from his kids. Smile a little bit, enjoy this, because here is your grandson in the big leagues. We talked to your son and, and your daughter-in-law last week at Kauffman Stadium, but what is this like for you to watch your grandson in the major leagues? Oh, it, I can't explain it. It just, <laughs> the insides are, are just rolling, rolling, and it, it's just great, you know. I was hoping my son could make it, but he, he got the AAA, but but this is this is great. And I, and I, I want to follow him as much as I can, but, you know, I got to go back home and pay some bills. Oh, okay, but, you know, keep on following him. You're having a great time, and, and for those that don't know the story, we've told it, but... You know, the rest of the family hopped on a plane last minute and flew to Kansas City and then came up to Chicago. I don't know too many 86-year-olds that just hop in a car by themselves and go drive across the country. But I was asking Witt about that. He goes, oh, yeah, he's crazy. Of course he'll do that. So tell me about that drive. Well, it's, it's only 1,200 miles. <laughs> and I love to drive. You know, I, and I, I just... Got rid of a Subaru that had 230,000 miles on it, and I got a, I got a 2016. It's got 31,000 on it already, and I've had it four months. <laughs> well, listen, we're, we're not going back to the West Coast at all this year, so everything is going to be East and Midwest. You could just start putting the mileage on that new 2016. I plan on going to Cleveland. I plan on going to Baltimore. Uh, Shoot, you could start hosting the pregame show with me. That, that'd be great, too. And, well, yeah, whatever you want, Mr. Merrifield. Hey, why not? <laughs> so here you are, and you're, and you're watching them. You know, you talked about feeling that on the inside, too. I mean, is, is it is it nerves? Is it, you know, the, the grandparents always love to spoil the grandkids. It's proud, you know. And uh, my daughter called me and said, show some enthusiasm. I said, well, mine's on the inside. I don't have to get up and cheer and, and do all this. I never was that kind, and, uh, but I love him, and he, I'm so proud of him. I don't know, couldn't be more proud than, than I am. It was so neat yesterday. I saw him come over here. You were sitting in the same row and in the third row here, and he came over to chat with you, and I saw you guys walking through the streets of Minneapolis, maybe going to lunch today. But I, it was funny because the other day I, I said to your son and to your grandson, Witt, I said, well, 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 you know, will your grandfather be going up to Minnesota or back home? And and Witt said, I don't know. He'll either show up or he won't. And and after the game in Chicago the other day, you still didn't know, did you? No. <laughs> and now I'm and now I'm teeter tottering whether to go to Kansas City or not. Listen, if he keeps hitting and they keep winning, you may not have a choice. You might have to come down and visit us. <laughs> I, I want to go to Kansas City. Well, listen, we would love to have you in Kansas City. We'd love to have you at Kauffman Stadium. And I think for all Royals fans and, and everybody watching right now, congratulations on, on seeing your grandson, Witt, up here in the big leagues. And by the way, I should also say that, that I put out a picture on Twitter. I assume you're not on that. And everybody was saying, this guy is not 86. He's got to be in his 60s. So you're looking good, too. Well, I feel pretty good. And I, you know, I, I drive five, six, seven hundred 700 miles a day. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Well, hey, I, I, th I, I think we should just stop flying on the team charter and, and, and just go jump on jump in the car here with Mr. Merrifield. Do you have a favorite memory so far watching Witt, first big league kid, first, all these firsts here? Well, uh, I think his, his first play at second base was a, a, a turn to double play. And, and I, I, I'll always, always remember that. And he also had a very big hit in the College World Series a few years back. He did. Yeah, he had the winning, winning hit in the College World Series. And uh, I've got pictures plastered all over the house from that. But, but yeah, I'm very proud of him. He's, 
I, I was hoping they would let him steal a while ago. <laughs> Maybe we'll get, get a steal. Maybe we will get that home run. But, you know, the one thing that everybody says as we look at some of the pictures is, is that, that this is a young man that has the intelligence, that understands the game, that plays it the right way. And I assume that's something that was passed on from your son. Yeah, that's true. And I just hope that he's here for a while. I hope he doesn't. I don't know how long you'll be here, but I don't know. But I'm I'm praying that he's you'll be here for forever. You know. Oop, that one got him in the foot, so we're going to get the hit-by-pitch here. Runners on first and second. Bill Merrifield, Mr. Merrifield, thank you so much for visiting with us, for sharing the thoughts on your grandson. Congratulations to you and all the family. A wonderful, wonderful family. Yeah, and, and I'm proud of all of them. And, uh, I hope I get to see you down in Kansas City. You are welcome anytime. Hey, Hud, how about... How about we just go road tripping with Bill Merrifield? Oh, I'm in. Are you kidding? <laughs> you can have shotgun, Joel. I'll sit in the back. <laughs> oh, that's perfect. Well, Bill's driving, and he's driving like 700 miles a day. Only an 18-wheeler driver yeah. could say that. Fizz, look, when you drive it, the turtle's <laughs> on your tires, man. Look, I bet he drives faster than you do. <laughs> he does. I'm a safe driver. 500 miles a, a day. That was awesome. Joel, great interview. Well, you know what? It won't be much longer. Bill Merrifield, you'll, your son, your grandson will be paying your bills, so don't worry about it.